plants capture sunlight and convert it to energy. This important process happens in the chloroplast, a plant cell's sugar factory. But what happens to the chloroplast during drought or when sunlight becomes too intense? Intense sunlight, coupled with reduced water availability, leads to the production of damaging reactive molecules which slow the chloroplast down. Fortunately, the chloroplast has a fire alarm system in place to recruit help. We've discovered that chloroplasts possess a sensor protein able to detect the reactive molecules, leading to release of an SOS signal a small molecule messenger. This SOS signal moves to the nucleus, the command centre of the cell. Here, the SOS signal triggers changes in gene expression that will ultimately help the plant to cope. New proteins are now built to help the cell. Some of these proteins become replacement parts for the damaged chloroplast. Others help to remove reactive molecules and prevent further damage to the chloroplast. Thus, the sensor protein and its downstream effects play a crucial role in helping chloroplasts to continue functioning in stressful environments, allowing plants to make the energy they require even when times are challenging. Our research could help us create even more sensitive fire alarm proteins and better protect plant cells in the future. By understanding communication processes in plant cells, our research can help make smarter and hardier plants that can better survive drought. And by making our crop plants more drought tolerant, we can ensure a more secure food future.